So if you now look at those 2D images, the, the one would be the top view, the one would be the side view, and the next sort of parameter that one often sees, and it's an important one, is the beam width. Now, antenna has not got like a beam that's got a certain width and then it disappears. What people refer to as a beam width is the point at which the tower drops. If that's the peak power, peak focused power, it drops here to half of its power, and half is also known as minus 3 dB. So it's the 3 dB beam width, also the half power beam width. Note that beam width is this complete arc. Um, in other words, it's not plus minus the beam width, the beam width is the complete arc that's covered. Also note that the gain is not maintained over that beam width. You're going to get the main gain, the P gain in the pattern, and up down to minus 3 dB. So if you're planning links um, that have to cover a number of sort of uh, different angles, uh, do keep that into account.